John, how are you, buddy? I'm great. How are you? We are well. Thanks for coming on. You look great. Like, we are <laughs> suffering, but you look fantastic. Uh, I mean, you look fantastic, too, Ryan. Come on. I mean, look, he's got a <laughs> holiday shirt on. He looks like, right? He's like, he's, he's wearing holiday wear. I've been trying to get dressed for these things. I feel like if I, I started out just doing everything in my t-shirt, my robe, and I was like, you know what? I'm, I, I, got, I got all these clothes. I might as well wear them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have, uh, I, I, I have been intrigued by your array of satin. Uh, you and Chrissy have a lot of satin. Chrissy has, oh, Chrissy has more robes than any human should ever have. She has many, <laughs> many silky, have you, silky robes. Have you, <laughs> have you been uh, finding it interesting, this experiment? I know that you guys are, um, you know, you, you, you post quite a bit up online, but how has it been interesting, this experiment for you and all of this? Well, one, just trying to find creative ways to entertain the kids has been uh, Exciting. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Chrissy's, exciting. Uh, Chrissy's bought camping equipment so we could camp in the backyard. <laughs> um, that was we've, cute. We've done a fake wedding for Luna's uh, stuffed animals. Oh, um, it's been wild times. Wait, that's a good idea. You know, sis, why don't you do a, a stuffed animal wedding for your twins? <laughs> I know. I saw this go down. I watched the entire, I think it was like a nine minute video of a wedding. <laughs> Oh, great. Right. So I watched it start to start to finish. Uh, L Luna requested Hands to Myself by Selena Gomez as the wedding song. <laughs> and uh, I, love and it. I, I sang it. I, I, uh, oh, it was funny. It's so good. So you, John, you've been releasing new music over yeah. the last few weeks. Yeah, well, we had uh, basically finished the album prior to everything happening. There's a few odds and ends we have to tie up. Um, yeah remotely but uh most of it was already done and uh we started out with conversations in the dark which was on uh an episode of this is us earlier in the year and then we put out actions and then we just put out bigger love we're making a music video for bigger love featuring our fans from all around the world um that's really cool and we just were like you know people still need music so um we should not give it right. to them because right. they're stuck at home um, we don't know what's going to happen with the tour and all these other things, but we can at least give them music to listen to. And so that's what we've been doing. Yeah, I think now more than ever, you know, it's like you, you can put in your headphones, you can walk into hopefully another room or even sit in your own closet and escape yeah. a little bit when you need to sit in your car. I mean, some people, yeah. you know, just go out and sit in their car. And you can still go on a drive now if you want to. There's certain <laughs> things you can still do. But obviously, there's some t times when you would listen to music that you aren't doing anymore, like on your way to work or <laughs> right. at, at the gym or all these yeah. other things that people would normally do. But um, people still need music. And, and I feel like the music we made, we didn't know it was going to be released during a crazy sure. time like this. But it actually feels like it's uplifting and inspiring for people right now. You're uh, doing something great with us tonight. We'll be, yeah. John and I will be together. This is something that we've been doing for a few weeks now on Fridays. It's called First Responder Fridays. Uh, yeah. And I, I know that you've seen the stories. I, I've, I've been reading so many stories and watching so many news stories about the men and women, the brothers and sisters of people listening that are working every single day selflessly. Yeah. And yeah. It, 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 it's inspiring. What, is, what struck you about all of it? Well... I think the scariest and most harrowing thing about it is for these medical professionals who might be exposed to the virus every day and can't really be close to their families because of it. Uh, we, um, we actually feature one of those people in, in our video uh, that's coming out. It's really a celebration of love and of life. And we got all these videos from different people that submitted all over the world. And uh, you just see how difficult it is for them to be around so much pain and suffering and sometimes death. And then for them to not be able to hug their kids when they go home because they're afraid they'll give the virus to the kids. Um, it's, it's really intense. And the sacrifice that these folks are making, of course, this is their job. This is something they signed up to do, but I don't think any of them knew that uh, it would be this intense and this scary to do their job and, and that it would, uh, make it so hard for them to, to spend time with their families. And so tonight we will salute them in every way possible and also we'll highlight some of those stories 
Well, John, thank you for coming on. I'll talk to you in a little bit. It's at 7 p.m. on iHeartRadio's YouTube page. You can listen also right here on 102.7 KISS FM. And I hope to eventually get to see you in person soon, somewhere, someday. Yes, we will. We will do it again. We'll, we'll get back to some kind of normal as soon as we can. But in the meantime, everybody stay safe and uh, take care of yourselves and take care of each other. Thank you, buddy. Be well. John Legend.